Hey guys, Shell with Custom Offsets, Custom Offsets TV on the YouTube. Got another SIM edition, hot new for you. We're over in the soda booth checking out the new JTO. This is gonna be one of their brand new wheels and it's gonna come in the 20 by nine. And then you're gonna have your 20 by 10 negative 19 offset. And it's gonna go all the way up to a 22 by 12. And that's gonna be in the negative 51. So you're gonna get as much lip as humanly possible. Throw a bill on there and just show you what that looks like. If I can find it in all my SEMA junk. So with that 12 wide negative 51, you're gonna see it's gonna eat up that whole dollar bill. So you're gonna basically have that six inch lip all day. If you go between the spokes, you're gonna have even more because you're at like six and a half, almost six and three quarter. The other size that they're coming out with the Jado in is gonna be the 22, nine and a half, and that's a plus 20. The goal of that one is that it's gonna fit on your stock fitments and give you that 22, but with that positive offset, it'll sit just inside the fender. So this is gonna be a big SUV or stock finish where you don't want it stanced out. And then it's just that smaller lip wheel, probably about a two inch lip on the stock fitment. What they've done with this one is you'll see it's got the milling inside of the spokes and it's got heavy machining inside of here and then all the way around and then it's got kind of the two piece wheel rivet look going all the way around the outside of it. And the other thing is this isn't just a clear coat. They went through kind of like a smoke, they call it their ghost coat over all of the machining, giving it kind of that grungy, kind of grayish look to it. And then it's got a gloss black all the way around it. And like I said, they've got it in, uh, multiple sizes. You'll see it's exposed lug nuts. So you can definitely run some spiked lug nuts, either the black to blend in, or you could do chrome and it would really pop because of the dimming of all of the machining on here. This one's also gonna be available in the Anthra coat. We'll show you that in a different video because that one basically looks like a different wheel once you do that finish on it. Price-wise, soda, you're gonna remember, because of all the heavy milling, they are towards the higher end of the cast wheels, but it's all about that attention to detail and the added features that they put in. Same thing with the outside lip. You'll see it's got the rivets in there, but they did go ahead and paint right over the top of them so they don't stand out as much. It's not. They wanted this wheel to blend in all the machining, and then same thing with the soda. It's gonna have that ghost finish on it. So that is your soda, Jado. Peace.